I have a question for you about your record of running. Um, so I've heard that in the past. You mean you, like running marathons and 10Ks? No. Nah, oh, you do you're that talking too? about something else. You do that too, huh? I, I've done that, yeah. You, you, you look like you're a runner. You look like, <laughs> you know, you're pretty healthy. So in the past, they said that you ran, you're running as a Democrat now. They said in the past you ran as a Republican. Yeah. Talk to me about that timeline yeah. and why would you ever, did you run as a Republican yes. and then why? Yes. Yeah. So in 1991, I was appointed. Okay, and I was in the 1992 election. Okay. And I remember my uh, 15, 14 other Republican colleagues uh, making a comment that it really doesn't matter what you say in this judge's meeting because in Jan uh, January of 1993, you ain't going to be here anyway. Gotcha. You're going to lose. Mm. And so I had an opponent mm -hmm. in the general election who'd never really handled a, a, a criminal case. He was a nice guy, but he didn't have my background. Mm -hmm. And so I campaigned real hard. I mean, just the same thing I keep doing, just campaigning real hard. And, and this is a Democrat. You were a Democrat. I ran as a Democrat. Democrat. I was the only Democrat to win Dallas County, and I won by the whopping total of 333 votes. Wow. Okay. Yeah, out of 525,000. So barely squeaked over the edge. Barely squeaked over. Then comes 94, and Ann Richards, with all her millions of dollars, loses. Okay. So and you're not on the ballot in I wasn't on the ballot in 94. You're in 96. No, that's okay. right. Okay. So it's going to be 96. So, I mean, to be quite honest, it, it was the night that, that people realized she was going to lose to George Bush that my phone started ringing. Really? Okay. And it was from African-American Democrats that said, you need to rethink what you're, what you, where you are and what you're doing. Okay. Okay? Mm -hmm. I'm not... You know, one of them is Senator West. Mm -hmm. I'll say that because mm -hmm. he has written a letter to the community to, to stop this. Mm -hmm. Explain the position of why yeah, he would uh, that switch. We wanted him to switch. And, okay. So you had the support of the <clears throat> Democrats at the time. Yes. That, hey, you might lose your seat. No, we'll lose it. You will, <laughs> you will lose your seat. Um, and switching <laughs> yeah. parties. Um, yeah. For the the ninety six election. Yeah, 96. and that didn't give me a free pass because guess who came after me? Them. Yeah. <laughs> the yeah. Republicans yeah. came after me. Because they knew you switch parties. Of course. So okay. So did you have a Democratic? Yeah. Well, uh, let me tell you. First of all, they weren't happy about me winning that ninety two election. Because you, oh man, you barely squeaked by. Got you. No, because yeah. they got outsmarted yeah. and outworked. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. So one of the things was back then. Um, was who was the presiding judge of the central jury room. Back then, the law was you got a jury summons because you had a voter registration. Okay. So if you were the presiding judge of the central jury room, your name went out on all these summonses uh, to okay. all these voters. Mm -hmm. And then the other thing was somebody needed to do orientation in the morning. And nobody wanted to be there at 8 o'clock in the morning to do the orientation. So I was like, I'll go down there and do it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So I went down for 18 months straight. Mm. Okay. But the other thing was is we raised the adequate amount of money to get our mail out. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. And we had good effective pieces. And, you know, we did all the things that you're supposed to do. We made a lot of public appearances as I do now. And mm -hmm. we get all that stuff done. And we squeaked by. Yeah. Okay. So they didn't. They weren't too happy. In fact, they they said, "Whoa, wait a minute. This central jury room thing's about to change." And I was like, oh, "Wait a minute. Why has it been this way for decades? And if I win an election, now we got to change it." Got you. I said, "You're not really interested in changing the, the that. You're interested in defeating me." Yeah. Mm hmm And so anyway, um, so then I I. Um, uh, said I was going to run as a Republican. Mm -hmm. And, you know, I mean, this was not a, a singular person decision. Right. And so um, I didn't have a, a Democratic opponent ever, mm -hmm. okay, because we weren't doing that. We were supporting criminal justice reform gotcha. and trying to get it done. Okay. And so, you know, they did the same thing in 96. They guess guess I had an African American <laughs> opponent <laughs> opponent in the Demo in the Republican Party. Oh wow! Okay. Yeah, same thing. Okay, so you switch parties, and then they still find someone to run against you. They still you. find somebody. You didn't have African a Democratic American. opponent. Nope. Okay, so never you're did. Ninety six. Okay, and obviously, and I get fifty nine percent of the vote in the primary, and that takes care of that. Okay. 
So then I never have an opponent. Four-year terms. Four-year terms. Four-year terms. <clears throat> and you Even though they weren't permanent. happy about it. I mean, so, so they would come to my office and try to get me to sign, you know, this Republican deal that says, you know, blah, blah, blah. blah. And it's, it's stuff that's not good for us. Yeah. I'm like, I ain't signing it. Yeah. You know, so mm -hmm. they'd send letters out to all the precinct chairs. He's really a Democrat, and he won't. And he's got Ann Richards' picture in his office, and he, <laughs> you know, and I was like, you know, man, y'all can do whatever, but I ain't signing it. Right. Okay. So the switching of the parties is really to to to, to keep along with the work that you've already been yes. doing. Yes. So Senator West and I were working on criminal justice reform. Senator Ellis and I were working on criminal justice reform. Uh, Sinfronia Thompson from Houston mm -hmm. and I were working on drug courts and getting those bills passed. Mm -hmm. um, I mean, I was working with the, our Democratic caucus yeah. to get this done. Mm -hmm. And, you know, I was contributing money to Democrats. I didn't mm -hmm. care. I mm -hmm. mean, it's like, come and get me. Yeah. You know, if you think you can. Yeah. So, come so on. how long did you uh, run as a Republican? Or Until 2008. Okay. 2008 is when it switched, uh, the county switched back. 2006. 2006. Okay. And you guys are in yeah. the midterm elections. Right.